But we begin tonight with a deadly attack on a sidewalk in the Bronx. A 40-year-old man shot in the back and killed. Eyewitness News reporter Stefan Kim with the story from Bedford Park. It is a section of the Bronx not unfamiliar with the sound of gunfire. I see three shots, but I, it's not fight crockett. You knew it was shots? Shots? Oh, come on, who don't know it's shots? New York. Is this a surprise? That someone happened? was shot? No. The corner of East 198th Street and Pond Place tonight littered with shell casings and swarming with detectives after a 40-year-old man was shot and killed around 1.45 this afternoon. He was rushed to St. Barnabas Hospital where he was pronounced dead. But it's the way it went down that has residents and witnesses confused. Sources say the victim didn't recognize his gunman, but the suspect knew him. He turned around and shot him in his back. That victim then stumbled down the block and collapsed down there. Witnesses say there was no interaction before the suspect opened fire and that the gunman seemed to be waiting in a parked car for his victim. This man says the gunshot went through the victim's chest. He walked over here across the street and I hear pop, pop, pop. So he runs back to me. I say, yo, you got shot. He got shot in the leg and the lower part of his chest. And he passed out right there at the corner by the bus stop right there. When I turn around to try to help him with it, I seen him in convulsions and vomit coming out of his mouth, so I can't help him, so I just call the police. Police have identified the victim as Kayvon Reed from Yonkers. Cops say the suspect was wearing a gray hoodie and a face mask and fled on foot. Investigators have video of the shooting. What they don't have is a motive. In the Bronx, Sefan Kim, Channel 7, Eyewitness News.